Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Family Dynamics. I have just been playing a little bit off camera just to speed things up a little bit. What is he doing? <laughs> Look at his face. I feel like he looks so different now that he is an adult. I don't know, he just like looks different to me. Definitely different than the Channing that, you know, when we first started this LP. Um, but I have been thinking, I wanted to give you guys a little bit of an update. I've been thinking I want Jade to, or Jade wants to actually get a little part-time job or just do some like miscellaneous, um, what are they called? Odd jobs. Yeah. Like the odd jobs. I don't know. Just because she is kind of getting bored just staying around the house and she wants to help them out, not just money wise, but she just wants to help him out um i know she has been the one who is taking care of eric while we are gone and doing stuff but penny is at home now and like i said i've been thinking that i do want penny to um kind of retire but she can work from home still so that's a good thing but it's just like a lot of pressure on her because she has to have like 25 million followers if she wants to advance in her career Right now she has 9 million, which is good, but like, it's just a lot of pressure on her and having two kids, well soon to have another kid, it's just a lot of pressure. So I've still been deciding on that. Jade really wants to do some odd jobs. Like here she is, well, she's gaming, but she, um, she just wants to do something other than just sit around the house, um, get to know Alan. Well, he's your husband. I think you know him anyways i mean we can just have her like be a babysitter like she could do it from seven to one or six to uh, six to twelve that would be a little bit too late um she could just be a retail employee i mean 33 dollars an hour that's honestly pretty good uh she could be a gardener although i don't really see her liking gardening that much and I'm not going to have her, like, start a brand new career. And the only thing about the odd jobs is that you have to, like, constantly go and look for them. Uh, what about the freelancing? Um, or we could just have her do the babysitting job. It's, like, a little bit easier. And it's only Saturday and Sunday. Okay, yeah, this is a good option because it's literally only Saturday and Sunday, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, so she only works Saturday and Sunday, so that's actually good. It's just, like, to make some extra money on the side. What's wrong with you, Bobby? What's wrong? Let's calm him down. And look how big Penny is getting, you guys. She's getting so big. Oh, Channing's coming over here. I think after we have this baby, I want Channing and Penny to, like, do something nice together. Go on a little date or something. Um, let me see if Eric... Yeah, Eric can wake up and we will have Channing come down here and, like, play with him a little bit. Let's Let's teach him to say please and thank you. We can maybe teach him to say sorry. Ooh, and then we need to reach level four of the gourmet cooking skill. So maybe we can make some gourmet dinner tonight. Or I guess it's breakfast right now. So maybe we can do like lunch or something. Um, I didn't know yogurt parfait was gourmet. <laughs> um, we will just do this uh fruit and yogurt parfait for for breakfast this morning he really wants to be friendly with channing and get to know his his son-in-law that's so sweet i think oh yeah so i oops i didn't mean to click on that but i actually added a holiday tomorrow we're gonna have a spring cleaning day because i think it's the first day of spring tomorrow or no i guess today was spring as well and then we have easter coming up on tuesday and then it is eric's birthday i can't wait to see what he looks like and hopefully we'll have our little baby by then um we should i mean we're almost in our third trimester so um so yeah oh penny wants to make something make a masterpiece or something oh something of excellent quality okay so i wonder does she have like any art um skill at all she's writing skill you know what we could get her into into doing art that could be like her new hobby i kind of want to do that um and then we can like sell our artwork uh online or on plopsy or sell it on or at like the street you know like we can put one of those things out here what what is it like the little vendors or whatever 
no it's somewhere oh here it is right here so i wonder if we can like yeah, put this out here and then people would come and like buy stuff that would be awesome is there like any different colors that we can do Ooh, like this wooden one yeah it's like rustic yeah that like that works out really good because i think we can actually just put this in her inventory and then she can literally just like drag it around anywhere oh dino do we need a cat you guys do we need a cat oh she's been very flirty we're gonna say it's because channing made this delicious food even though she has a disgusted face right now it's because of that but i really also i really need to like give her a makeover i'm kind of tired of seeing the clothes but i'll probably do that after she after she has a baby i'm really ready to have this baby oh dangerously tired oh no well come on home we don't want anything bad to happen to you girl oh this house is so cute this house is so cute you guys oh can we say hi to the baby i want to see that interaction Oh, oh my goodness. That's so cute. Okay. So, I do want to, yeah, like I said, I do want to talk about relationship fears. So, it looks like we have to go. Oh, here we go. Talk about relationship fears. Not to talk. Don't flirt in front of your parents. That's embarrassing. Oh, he's going, Channing's going to go ahead and go to work. Okay, good. Because we need some money. Alright, let's teach him how to talk. I swear, I still have trouble navigating <laughs> the menu and stuff like that. New family dynamic. When it comes to Pe Penny and Eric, a sense of order seems to abound as a younger Sim has a deeper respect for their older family member, often meeting the older family member's expectations. You know what? Let's like, yeah, let's mix things up. Let's just make things a little dramafied. <laughs> I'm not saying this is drama, but I think that Penny... Just coupled with her being stressed out about the new baby and Eric getting older. I would say he's probably like two or three right now. He's at that age where he's like getting into everything. And maybe it's not necessarily strict, but in my mind, Penny is definitely getting on to him more. And just being that... She has to step up and be that like... I guess not i don't want to say strict but she does have to be strict and and step up and be that be that parent i mean so does channing i'm not saying that he doesn't either but he's definitely more of like the goofy um penny's a little bit more serious when it comes to parenting not that channing isn't serious either but i would say yes i don't want their relationship to be bad but eric is definitely at that age where he's gonna have to like um learn what not to do and just learn learn how to get older and, and be better that is literally the cutest thing i've ever seen okay I also just realized Channing doesn't have his wedding ring on. Why does he not have his wedding ring on? I'm going to change that really quick. Nope. He doesn't have it on at all for even his everyday outfit. Okay, well, we need to put that on. Um, let's see. I forgot which one we had him wearing. I mean, is that is that all there is? For wedding ring options? He wears it on, yeah, it's on his left hand, so, okay, um, athletic wear, he can, or hot wear, actually, he can have it on, and then when it's snowing, he can have it, okay, I kind of want to change his hair color to the, um, oh my god, should we do it, you guys, like, he is getting old, but he's not, he can't, He's not that old yet, but men do typically get gray hair before women do, so maybe we could do that. Oh my gosh, guys, look at this one. I kind of like this one. It's not longer, but it's just like a different style. It's like a more mature style. I kind of like it, you guys. I kind of want to keep that one on him. And then we got Penny here. Let's see what she would look like with, um, with gray hair. 
Oh no. And it's lighter too. I don't like that. Never mind. I like her darker brown hair. Why don't they have a better like gray hairstyle? Because that's just like too light of a brown. It's not the same thing at all. Let's see what other we can put on her. We got this high pony. Pigtails. No, I don't see that on her. Um, we got a messy bun with like braids. Oh, that's so cute. Was that a braid? Yep, it's kind of a braid right there. Um, let's see. That's cute. Like just a messy big bun. Okay, I feel bad, but I went ahead and sold some stuff. Well, literally everything in this room except uh, just this little toy box and then these little blocks because we needed some money. We need anything that we can get and I think I feel like this is enough for him right now um, I mean he's about to be a child anyways so um, so yeah all right I'm going to have Penny start working on painting because she really wants to to start doing that um, she's just been inspired by Brentleton Bay in the springtime just how it looks like it's so gorgeous out here that she she really wants to so she's doing a little figure painting right now um you know it's not gonna be good because she doesn't have any skills but or any skill in this in the uh painting but oh a fire what oh my gosh channing did you really start a fire did you really start a fire did you really start a fire extinguish extinguish okay i understand but somebody has to are you gonna make your mother do this? Okay, I guess we have alarms, so. Okay, Bruno or Bobby, you need to go away from the fire, honey. Okay, I guess he's, is he really chasing his tail? Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, a thousand dollars, holy cow. That really sucks. That just really sucks. You know what I was thinking, guys? There's one thing that I forgot about, and that is the new um, kitchen supplies that we got with that uh, game pack. Dude, what is happening right now? No, we need that door. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm a mess right now. Okay. But that new... The stuff that we got with that new kitchen pack. Where did it go? Here we go. Yes, the waffle maker and then the pizza maker. I feel like Channing would be, would love to do that. He would love to um, sell pizza and stuff on the street here in Brindleton Bay. And kind of like, kind of like Penny is picking up the painting thing, I feel like Channing would like to do that. So we're going to do that. And it's just an extra way to make money too. And also get his food out there and get his cooking out there and his name out there before we purchase our own restaurant, you know? Um, he could tell everybody, hey, yeah, I'm opening up my own restaurant soon. And this is like a little preview of what I'm going to be selling or what I'm going to be, you know, what my restaurant's going to be about. So we could do that. Oh yeah, the Home Chef Hustle. That's what, what it's called. I forgot. <laughs> Um, okay, so where is the food stand? Here we go. Any, any, where, any fair food stand. Okay. Let's see, what color should we make it? Let's see. I kind of want it to just be neutral right now because I don't necessarily want Channing to do specifically, just specifically pizza or just specifically, um, you know just just specifically one thing like i want him to do all sorts of all sorts of things we'll go ahead and put like a waffle maker and a pizza maker over there instead of in here we'll just put our dough our dough maker right here can we put this anywhere oh yeah we can but then that's also i think that's a, like a spot to put like food and stuff like that so i don't want to take that up right now um Oh no, our toilet broke. It seems like it's just like everything. Everything's going wrong right now. Okay, let's have Channing make some dough. Okay, our batter is done. So we will go ahead, or our dough, not batter. So we'll collect the ingredients and then we'll have him make some, some batter. 
I cannot wait to have this baby. Like, I'm just, I'm so ready. Let's have her cry it out. Who's calling us again? Oh, Tariq wants to come over. Yes, please come over, Tariq. I haven't seen him in so, so long. You guys remember Tariq, right? All right, so now we can have him go downstairs and make some stuff. Let's have him cook some pizza. Um, oh, we have a lot of stuff we can make. I guess since we have, um, yeah, since we have like level 10 cooking skill, we can make a lot. So let's make a, let's make a seafood pizza. I know that sounds really gross, but like, I feel like it's really fitting since we're in Brindleton Bay. So we'll do that. And then we can cook some waffles. Let's do... Oh, if it was fall time, it would be perfect for that. But let's just do some apple bacon waffles. That sounds really, really good right now. So we got that cooking and we got this about to cook. I love how we can just like kind of... You don't have to sit there and stand there and watch it. Like you can just kind of leave it, you know? So let's see. Change business details. Ooh, brand or food stand. Okay. Mm, what should we do? Channing's... <gasps> Ooh, Channing's Chomps. We'll just do Channing's Chomps or Channing's... Yeah, Chan... Oops. Um, let's put... Yeah, there we go. Channing's Chomps. Cute. Okay, so are we almost done? About 14, 12 minutes. Okay. All right, so it should be in our inventory. And then we will go ahead and put it, like, in in this let's go ahead and make like one more pizza okay so let's put this in here and then we'll start a food cell uh yeah yeah okay here we go i was like where is the food oh so we can okay we can place the food like wait where did it go what there we go okay i was confused for a second all right so this is 52 dollars this is 28 dollars and this is 40 so we can make a lot of money if we um get customers our first customer a main and michelle let's talk to a main she looks a little bit sad right now let's give her a cheerful introduction oh that worked she's buying oh. how did we just get 350 dollars oh she bought the whole thing she literally bought the whole pizza well that's nice of you but like now we don't have anything else to sell except these two things um so they all bought stuff already that was easy let's give him a cheerful introduction it seems like we're really hitting it off with this gareth guy like he is super nice oh my gosh look at that look at all these people oh look who it is it's lizbeth and alden from ocean sims i put them in my game because they're just like they're just so cute. I love them. Um, and then we have Baptiste. And then we have Nadine. Let's talk to Nadine. Let's give her a friendly introduction or a cheerful introduction. She's so cute. Oh my gosh. If we weren't married, like, she's so cute. Um, and then we have Jamal. I think we already talked to Jamal. Let's talk about... Let's have a deep conversation about, about waffles or something okay can we make another pizza because we're running out of stuff to sell let's do a garden pizza for you know the spring it's kind of fitting and then we'll make another uh this time we will do a cured fish waffle <gasps> we're going into labor we're going into labor we're going into labor oh she's so hungry though let's have her eat really quick though before we go into labor wait what was that option oh i was like what is that okay everybody chill out oh wait do we have a ghost what is this marcus oh my gosh marcus is dead let's talk to elizabeth cheerful introduction oh okay let's see how much we made oh my gosh we made a thousand dollars you guys if we do this every day we will get there in no time and if we have more options too like i can't believe that okay 
so let's have her go ahead and go um let's do a home birth this time actually no all right let's have her go ahead and go have baby at hospital i'm gonna go ahead and send her alone this time we'll obviously chaining we'll we'll be going with her but i don't want to have to do all of that stuff that we did last time it was fun but having to do that every time is a little bit annoying because it took forever you guys the excitement that i'm feeling right now it's a girl i wanted it to be a girl so bad and i'm so glad that it's a girl okay i'm gonna think of a name i forgot to ask you guys for names i can change it I can totally change it, but right now I'm just going to come up with the name by myself. Um, but let me know down in the comments what other names that you have in mind, because I can definitely change it. I'm so surprised that we did not have twins because her belly was so big. Um, oh, I forgot about the food. Does this food go bad? We'll go ahead and like put it in the storage or whatever but we have a little baby girl and her name is willow i decided to name her willow i thought that was such a cute name so willow it is let me change let me move her her crib we'll keep her in here for now but i just didn't want her crib to be like right by the bed um well can i not put it here we'll put it like right right there just like right by the bed right there okay Hopefully they can still get in there. Okay. Anyways, yeah, we have a little girl and her name is Willow and I am so excited about that. We do still have to have one more baby for the challenge to be completed, but we have a little girl. I was wanting a little girl and I'm so happy that we did. I, I kind of want the next baby to be a boy. Like, so we have two boys, two, or one girl. I just thought that would be cute, but we will see um but yeah that is gonna be it for this episode we had a lot of stuff happen and i i didn't tell you why how, why is this girl coming to my house um but yeah that's gonna be it i really hope you guys enjoy this little episode and i will see you all next time bye guys